Harry Lake joining us right now, Arizona Senate candidate. Well, I congratulate you. And when I heard uh, cinema drop out, Carrie, I'll be honest with you, full disclosure, folks, I texted Carrie and said, come on, let's talk about this today. I was watching, Carrie, the left, the, the liberals at CNN and MSNBC saying, oh, this is, this is really great for Gallego. I disagree. In a state like Arizona, we have a Republican, Carrie Lake, and one Democrat, Gallego, the border becomes so much more important. Tell us why you think this is great for you. Uh, thank you for having me on tonight, Eric. Um, it is good for us because we, we saw that when Kirsten Cinema made two or three courageous votes to save the filibuster, the left and the Democrats turned on her like a pack of wild dogs. Mm -hmm. And that's when Ruben Gallego came in and said, we're going to take her down. And the Democrat Party turned on her for doing something that was right. Now, listen, I disagree with Kirsten Cinema on almost every policy, but I, I applaud her for her courage to stand up for the filibuster. And, and we're looking at polling, and we've had many polls that have been done for the entirety of this year, and it showed that she was taking a few more Republican votes than Democrats because the Democrats have gone so full tilt to the left. They're not even Democrats of yesteryear. They are full on, frankly, Marxist radicals. And so we're happy that, um, that you know, Senator Sinema is now realizing that she doesn't have a path to victory. We're wishing her the best. We thank her for those courageous votes. And now we are dead set on stopping the communist push of America Democrats to, uh, to basically destroy our country. Ruben Gallego is, is for open borders. He says border walls are stupid. He wants everybody pouring across the border to have voting rights to vote in this next election. He's against the iron.